all right guys so i have a quick update to share with you uh we are still talking about what is going on what is trending in nigeria greetings to you wherever you are it's a beautiful sunday morning uh the 18th day in the month of june 2023 all right guys um still talking about the case of uh, godwin and Mephiele. of course we already know the suspension and um detention of Godwin and Mephiele. So I am not going into details of that particular story, uh, but to give you guys developing story, okay? Just like I promised to keep you guys updated on a Mephiele and Bawa's issue, okay? So make sure you subscribe, turn on your bell notification so uh, you get updated as soon as I um, have more developing story for you guys, okay? So today is um 18 June, it's a beautiful Sunday morning. Uh, 18 June 2023. 20, uh, okay, the latest update I have for you. Uh, remember some time ago I told you guys that a Mephiles passport has been seized from him. Of course, um, according to DSS, uh, it is always um, part of their investigation, okay, that somebody's passport has to be taken away from him uh, to enable them to carry out their investigation. It's a uh, normal protocol for them okay so that is by the way and i also updated you that um during the week his house will be searched it was from a close source from uh the dss uh during an exclusive uh, report from sarah reporters that a mephiles resident will be you know searched during the week and also um uh, dss also had an expert motion order from the court to keep a mephiles as long as they want so that they will be able to carry out their investigation so the latest update i have for you today being sunday is that um 18 ghana must go back containing money and documents has been you know discovered by the dss from the resident of uh, a mafia that is his lagos resident so it was also gathered that the money and the document were taken from uh, his lagos resident on friday that was friday afternoon after about a day long search on the property so uh you know which i think his property will be um kind of a mansion as big as possible so it will take uh dss and um intelligent officers to make sure that they search every nooks and cranny of that house you understand what i mean all right so um that is the update i have for you so according to um, the source, they said the Mephiele may spend longer than earlier reported uh, in DSS custody as investigation into his activities while in charge of uh, Central Bank is far from being concluded. I mean, this man had a lot of um, cockroach in his cupboard, like seriously. So according to source that a Mephiele may stay longer than um, expected, okay? And they said uh, he was... Um, moved from uh, DSS custody in Abuja on Thursday and then flown to Lagos where his house was searched by the DSS, okay? And then according to the conclusion of the search, about um, 18 Ghana must go back containing currency and document were said to have been taken away uh, the following day. That is Friday, from Thursday to Friday, okay? His house was searched. I mean, 18 Ghana must go back. Just imagine hey, one full Ghana must go back, how much that could be. And then they discovered 18 of it. Imagine Ghana must go 1,000 1, currency or not. Nobody knows if it was in dollar, okay, because the DSS did not disclose it here. But just imagine full, full Ghana must go back, one of, one of it. Just imagine how much that could be. And then 18 was discovered in his house. I mean, what are you doing? First of all, that is another, I don't know how to put it, another charges for you to have such huge amount of money in your possession, okay? And it is not in the bank for you to have such huge amount of money. And these are the same people that we're talking about the Naira redesigning, that Tinibu halfway houses start with a naira note and these are the same people that have such huge amount of money do you do you know what 18 ghana must go back 
uh, what how much as in it contain. Let us try to imagine that. Okay, so that is um, the latest update I have for you on MFPLA. So like I said, I will keep you guys updated uh, what is going on uh, on the case of MFLA and BAWA. <laughs> Don't forget, uh, they are yet to face BAWA own. You understand? I'm just trying to imagine how many Ghana must go. Uh, there were DSS would discover in BAWA's house. Seriously. Because what it stands now is as soon as, um, you know, these guys have been arrested, what I understand is that um, the security operative may, you know, lay kind of ambush on the arrested and maybe for their family member not to be moving properties or moving out some evidence. So that is what I discovered, okay? Because ever since a Mephile was arrested, you know, the family member may like, okay, let us try to move some exhibit and so on, okay? So I believe maybe those security agencies... <clears throat> must have lay kind of siege on their property so that anybody going out or people coming in or people going out uh, will be thorough, um, you understand, investigated, or they will have to search anybody going out and anybody coming in. So according to um, the DSS, uh, they said they have launched a manhunt on um, MFLA's personal assistant, okay? Um, because, of, of course, personal assistant should be able to know everything, uh, the activity of uh, the yoga. You understand what I'm saying? So DSS said they have launched a manhunt. Of course, that's a secret police. They have all the equipment uh, to track somebody. So as long as the person is still in Nigeria, maybe any moment, any time soon, uh, his personal assistant uh, will be tracked and uh, arrested, okay? So they said they have... Um, you know, launch a manhunt uh, to arrest uh, a MFLS personal assistant. Because, yeah, it's possible. The, that person may be innocent, the person might be guilty, whatsoever. But what I came to understand is that um, a MFLS will not love to go down alone. All their accomplices, okay, that is involved in this MFLS travel or that was involved in this Naira redesigning saga. I remember some time ago when the MFLA said this inner application, okay? The inner that nobody's using. I don't I, I don't even know if the inner is working. I remember when MFLA said they want to, you know, redesign the application. Uh that it is a, a US company that will, you know, redesign those maybe some bugs in that application so that the inner will function well. And it was about billions of naira. If not million, I think I remember billions of now just to go and redesign Android app to go and fix. And this thing, we have uh, tech gurus in Nigeria here. I'm not bragging about it. We have tech gurus in Nigeria here that can take care of such, even as less than one million naira, even to, to redesign that inara from A to Z. Tech guru, they are here in Nigeria that can make such application, redesign that application, and it works perfectly. What about the banking app? What about the banking script? Nigerians gurus, they can take care of those, but they have to, you know, designate billions of Naira just to go and redesign a common Android application and iOS. I mean, these people, they were brainwashed, they were making caricature of Nigerians. Okay, that is the latest update. Um, see you guys in another video.